right. <laughs> you should be home. You know, whatever. It's just weird being here right now at this time. But that's what we got to do. Hey, uh, during during this trip, as a team, you guys are looking to accomplish what? Um, I guess just to test ourselves. You know, get a different competition. Um, you know, try to get more chemistry as a unit. I, mean, I feel like we already have really good chemistry already. So I guess it should be an early test before the season actually starts. Mm -hmm. Better chemistry than last year? Oh, yeah. By far. Why do you say by far? I think everyone just bought in and know what we have to do. I saw what happened last year. And we know what we, what we actually have to play defense and buy into the. <laughs> does that help? <laughs> it, it does help. <laughs> you know, it helps you um, when everybody's buying into the system and to what Romar's trying to do. Did, did, so what did like that not happen last season? No, I mean it happened at times. We saw it at times, but at other times it was just horrible. You know, we thought we didn't have to play defense every every possession, every play. That showed. Was that just a team thing, or was that kind of individuals every now and then, and then it became a team thing? Um, I don't know if it was like a team thing. I mean, we all believed that we had to do it, but nobody actually really bought into it. Was was like that talked about during the offseason, or did you guys just sort of innately know when we come back, things have to change? Um, I mean, we lightly touched on it, but I think everyone knew like this is the year where everyone knows that they have to buy in and do everything right for us to be successful since we're not as talented as, as we have been. Did like you notice that buy in immediately, or like after the first practice, or uh, immediately? We always had people in the gym extra. You know, we have six or seven guys in the gym at once, outside of practice, outside of workouts, and that kind of thing that everybody knows what they have to do. Health wise, were you able to do everything? I mean, hip and everything, you're fine now, I mean, like last year? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been, I've been good. I mean, is, it, is it kind of nice? I mean, after last year, what you were going through? Yeah, it's definitely nice. I took time, time off last year after the season and, you know, got back right. So I'm just kind of playing it by ear if I feel anything similar to what I felt before, I'm just going to let everybody know early. So to say that this year's team isn't as talented as last year, is that does like, is that humbling at all, or is that just the, the, the like facts of the matter? I think, you know, can't really get around it. We lost Terrence and Tony, and those are two great talents. But I feel like we, I feel like we have a lot of solid players, a lot of potential, and as, far, as long as we buy into what we're trying to do. What are, your, what are your thoughts on this one three one kind of or this high post offense that the coach has kind of started and kind of your initial thoughts of it? Um, for me personally, I think it's going to put me in a better position to score, get the ball more. Um, it keeps the the bigs into the offense as well. Like a lot of our offense lies on the bigs at the high post. Um, there's a lot of options, a lot of reads. I think it'll be hard to scout. You know, it's pretty easy to scout us a lot of times because we do the same thing. But there's so many options off this that we can always make a read. And, have you, have, have, you got, have you seen, like, the progress of it, or has there been steps back to where you're like, oh, man, what are we doing here? And stuff like that. I mean, there's always going to be that, especially this early, but for the most part, I think everybody's kind of getting it, uh, getting in a rhythm. Our offense looks really, well, really good right now because that's all we've been working on. So, I mean, by the time the season comes, I think we'll be really good at it. And uh, it puts you in better p positions to score in what ways? Like, you're doing what? I'm coming off screens a lot more. Yeah, coming off screens, back cutting, um, setting up guards, and Staggers, screen downs, a bunch of stuff. So you got because yeah. by the end of the last season they weren't letting you. You know, it seemed like teams just weren't going to let you get the ball. Yeah, kinda. yeah. It was easy last year to sit in the corner, and watch everybody do everything else. But this year everyone's moving, cutting, setting screens. So it's going to keep the defense off balance a lot, a lot more of the time. So to say you guys are solely focused on offense, does that mean you haven't worked on defense or not as much? Uh, we put in like a defensive scheme every day for practice for like 15, 20 minutes with everything. The rest of the practice is off. But I think this week we're going to start doing more defense stuff so we're decent when we go. Were you more high post oriented in high school? Yeah. Or were you in AAU? Uh, uh, AAU, not so much, but high school, yeah. So Have you gotten a sense of what this means to Aziz, this trip, to, you know, obviously the Europe part of it, but to go to Sunday morning and all that? Yeah, uh, we had a class about it earlier and he kind of opened up and just told, told everybody how. How different it was for him to come out here and stuff, and kind of humble and secure, you know, where he came from. Now you get to go back, and it's really cool. cool to hear. Is, are you, what, are, what are you most excited about for the trip? Is it that part, or going to Spain? I think everything. I've been out of the country, so it's just going to be 
exciting to see a whole different culture. You know, nothing I've ever experienced in my life. How many guys do you think have been out of the country on your team? I think there were three that had been. Abdul have been to Canada, but it doesn't really count. So uh, most of the guys haven't been out of the country, so it's going to be a crazy experience for everybody. Uh, 